<laughs> Hello. <laughs> Welcome oh back. no, underwater and cannibals. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Callum accidentally pressed on the level, so we're immediately carrying on. Sunken ghost ship. I, I, I don't remember any of this. Have I just hit my head enough times as an adult? I think so. I can't... Oh, I can sort of remember, but... Uh... Yeah, this is... This is this escapes me. But I know I got I wouldn't, pre the... I wouldn't press click if I knew this was... Oh, this is a ghost ship, I remember. This is I literally what I just said. It's a sunken ghost ship. But, fair enough. Whoa! Oh. Whoa! Okay, Way I was too much. not expecting that. Oh god. Oh god. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, fucking... This is horrible. I can't, I can't believe I'm a grown man, like, this invested. <laughs> this. this scares me more than, you know, the latest Resident Evil looks scary. Uh, what? Oh! Oh my god. I and they keep moving as well, not where they were before. But I... I oh! You nearly swam straight into that one. That would have been so, so unfair. I don't think they're allowed to spawn around you. I think the game's, like, coded, so... Ah, oh, we're through! We're through! We're Louis Theroux. Oh. Oh my god. Um. Oh my god. The new Resident Evil looks so good. That's what I was going to say. It looks great, but I don't think I'd be able to. I don't think I'd be able to handle it. Do you not like scary games? No, I can't deal with them. It's it's certain games I have, I refuse to play just because. <laughs> <laughs> like, I really, I really, really want to play Alien Isolation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I just know that my nerves aren't up for it. Yeah, yeah, I can watch, yeah. I can watch any sort of scary film. I'm fine with that. I know, there is there is a certain level, isn't there? Oh, kill, kill shit. Are you just, are you just falling? Yeah. Oh, this is awesome. Fuck him up! There's just nothing you can do here. No. Oh wait, have you, have you probably got to land on something? I'm guessing so. What the, what the hell? <laughs> ah! What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> wait, we've got to go back to the beginning? I think so. Oh, that's bullshit. So, yeah, I love scary games. I, I really love them. Oh, fuck off. Oh, at least you got Yoshi, so you're right. <laughs> oh, well, maybe. <laughs> Don't, don't speak to the siren. Ugh, the fucking shit! No, no! Ha, ha, ha! Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> welcome to 20 minutes of trying to jump on Yoshi. <laughs> yeah, welcome to Nathan's different fucking monkey impressions. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Uh, oh, God, I went to Monkey World recently. Um, not that I necessarily agree with uh, animals in captivity, but uh, my, my family went to Monkey World with my little nieces, and they loved it. And, I don't know if it was, it, it wasn't Howler Monkeys, it was some sort of like, gibbony thing, but it was so funny. Every, like, my nieces ran up to the, uh, oh no! Uh, ran up to the little fucking, oh, oh. Enclosure. And these monkeys are just like, whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Like a car alarm. I mean, little, like, little nieces, bless them. We just join again, like. Wah! Go, go! Oh! Look at that skill. Fucking! I, I, there's no point trying to talk at all. Have you ever seen a video of a guy showing an orangutan a magic trick? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I have. Wait, no. I think I've seen a, the iPad magician uh, doing stuff with chimpanzees. I have not seen an orangutan. It's just, he's got something in a cup. Yeah, he does yeah. Something, takes out the cup. The amount of joy on this bet, orangutan's face. Oh is, shit! I bet the orangutan look fucking hell. But like, it just rolls on its back, and it's just like really like, <laughs> slap, <laughs> slapping its leg. That's amazing. Like, it's the best thing you've ever seen. Um, I had uh, a guest lecturer once when I was in university. It was a woman who uh, worked in Borneo, and she was an app developer, but she was also a zoologist. And she very specifically developed apps and devices, touchscreen devices, for orangutans to um, study their development and their learning skills. It was really fucking fascinating. It was so good. I, can't, I really, I wish I could remember this woman's name. She was the best lecturer I'd ever had. It was only one one lecture, but that was the, the most fun I ever had in uni. 
And she <laughs> was just talking about how, like, um, these apes, like, you really have to understand and appreciate how close to us they are and the amount of things they learned and they picked up and they really got, got so many like, uh, dynamics of gaming and stuff like that. But also, like one times out of five, they'd completely forget this thing they'd picked up 50 times before and just like put it in the mouth and just be like, Arr! like <laughs> they still just had that animal idea of like, yeah, I've done this before, I've played this. Is it food though? <laughs> like, the oh, dude, orangutans are my favorite, I think. Oh, I love them. That's it, damage boost through. Oh, what's it was? Yeah, orangutans are just so cool. So desperately endangered as well. Yeah, it's heartbreaking. Oh, God. Oh, go on, go on, go on. Okay, let's, we can do this. There was loads of bits in the middle. Ah, oh, you got the coin. Are you just gonna go to the right and see what happens? Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah! What Ooh. what killed you last time? Uh, big spikes, <laughs> like one of those things. Oh right, right, right. Oh yeah, yeah. Yes. Boom. Fucking in it to win it, mate. Oh, I just, I just go, go to the right, go to the right. I reckon we'll, we'll avoid stuff then, maybe. What the hell was that? <laughs> I'm not it, but I. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet, we did it! Awesome! Oh my god. Oh yes. Oh, it's I... Bowser World! Look at that shit! Oh! It looks like the, the rock golem from uh, Never Ending Story. Fucking save that shit! No. No time for the. And I love the way that Bowser owns what looks like a casino. <laughs> Come on in! Wait, this is the end, isn't this it? This is the last world, yeah. Oh, I thought there was eight, but I can see the, the clown car. Oh, fucking yes, man. I reckon we could complete this today. We can do it. Yeah, well, depending on, depending on how much time well, we have. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we thought we could do it about three hours ago. Yeah, we, we've been doing this for a while. Hey, wow. Mr. Mole. Oh, oh. Oh, fucking, I'm really exaggerating, and not on purpose. I think a mixture of coffee, exhaustion, and uh, uh, having, like, practicing vocals and stuff recently has caused me to just be making such weird noises. I've been trying to, because I sing and stuff as well, I've been trying to practice using my voice, which is why I always have, like, cough sweets and stuff. Fuck you, mole. Um, so, I've been trying to make my voice more dynamic and engaging and listen to myself back and kind of... I'm making more noises when you... Oh! <laughs> oh! 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 Uh, well, it's not just making noises, it's... It's so easy um, to get into the habit of just talking like that and, you know, being really monotone and completely deslining about stuff. Three up! Three. Fuck yeah! Not to shit on Des Lyman, but he's got a very monotone voice. Bam, bam, and as well, like, I'm trying to I'm trying to be appreciative of the fact that like I'm gonna have to edit most of these and, until the foreseeable future when like, I can maybe get someone else. So like I've I've got to listen to my voice so much. Ah uh, yeah, definitely. Just... <gasps> That's what I'm I don't think I'm ever gonna listen back just because <laughs> <laughs> I hate my voice. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I agree with that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, your voice. Yeah, I've, I've heard it. Uh, yeah, I, I think I've said before about when I used to do the radio and stuff. But I'm, it's so much worse when it's a singing voice, though that's possibly the thing where you need to listen to your voice the most. Oh, oh definitely, yeah, you don't want to be just... Uh, uh, like, if, if you want to be a good singer, you have to listen to your voice. And you have to learn um, how to improve. Uh... Oh, fucking... Fuck! Fuck! Oh, bollocks, what's down here? Anything? Any... Oh! Oh, oh. oh. oh my god, yes! <laughs> Fuck secrets, don't care, do it! 26! Through! Um, yeah, like, I've done so many things where I've been trying to sing and sing seriously and I've had singer lessons, but then I listen to my voice back and I'm just like, I hate it, I hate it! Um, but that's why I've started just trying to do comedy music. Uh, yeah, you should change it a bit more then. 
Hmm? You change a bit more then. Like, yeah, as well. Like if it's comedy music, I listen back to it and it's shit. Then like that's that's fine. It doesn't it doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm not trying to be good. Oh, and it's the only way I've found in my life that I can continue to write music, not hate it, and also write comedy at the same time. Oh, you had you really didn't need to fuck him up. I like that extra touch of like nah, just in case. Yeah. Oh oh oh. Fucking oh. heat seeking shell. Go, go! I'm pressing like old controls. I was pressing down. Ah. I was pressing down for ages. Yeah, yeah. Butt drop it. That's what happens when you've got more than one Mario game on the go. <laughs> yes, and fucking that's the one of the annoying things about Super Mario Maker as well. Well, I say annoying. It's not that hard to remember all of it, but it's definitely not universal, is it? And you're trying to remember like which uh, which version you're playing. Oh, of course, you yeah. Can do. Do you wall jump? Can you? Oh, I've screwed the pooch. <laughs> Fuck! Whoa. Whoa! Oh, that was me, I think. Sorry. Sorry about that. That's like, that's a rage quit, though. Like, yeah. Fuck <laughs> this game! Yeah. Oh, well, the thing is, we're, we're, at some point, we're gonna have to, like, play a really, really tough game. To, like, to prove that we're good. Because I'm good at certain games. Like, I still want to play through either... I want to do either Twilight Princess or Wind Waker or something, but on a hard mode. Because it does change the game so much. Ah, oh, you G! Check out those moves! Alright, let, let the turtle yeah, relieve... Die. Let the turtle die. Or just leave you alone. Uh. Yes! Come on, <laughs> we've got the skills to get through <laughs> here. Yeah, I want to play. Uh, to be fair, I want to really enjoy it if we play a Zelda game on this show. I, I don't want to make it a stressful experience. Oh, what? Uh. Yeah, I really want to go do Twilight Princess game, but I want to do that in my own time, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, I'm not, I'm not going to make you play. You just come in, I'm like, no, fuck you. Twilight Princess HD. Dun, dun, dun. Though, to be fair, if I, is, I think. It, after our career time, I think it's my favourite Zelda game. No way! That's very interesting. Did you know that was there? Or I didn't. Just I, just thought, level design? I just thought, why is that like that? That's way too suspicious, isn't it? Oh, what's this? Um, I don't know what that does. Uh, see, I, I, uh, Ocarina then Twilight Princess. That's fucking interesting. What would you say? Um, Wind Waker. Then a link to the past, then a link between worlds, then Majora's Mask, then Ocarina of Time, and possibly then Twilight Princess. Wow, it's like so different to mine. Yeah. Oh. Um, that's not accounting. The obviously, there's more than that. Those, those are my top ones, and the one. Those are all the games that I've loved, like really, really loved, and like I, uh, um. Yeah, I really loved Twilight Princess. Even though it's further, even though it's far down, I loved that game when it came out. I, I fucking, I queued for the Wii at midnight, man. That was ten years ago now. I queued for the Wii at midnight. I drove home. Uh, I drove me and Dan home like so dangerously quickly because I had fucking <laughs> Zelda in my fucking boot as well as Wii Sports and uh, and a Wii, and we stayed up till like eight in the morning playing it. And for the first time to just be pointing it around and stuff like that fucking blew my mind. I remember my girlfriend bought me one. Yeah. A few months after it came out, because, well, just because uh, it sold out. Everywhere. Yeah, yeah. Prilled in mine like a pro. Um, oh, you should have gone when you were when it was going up. Uh, yeah, no, I was, was forgot where everything was. Um, yeah, and then I remember she surprised me with it. What a girlfriend! That's pretty good. And then she made me wait, so we had to have dinner before. Oh, fucking, alright, take it back. What a bitch. <laughs> That's horrible. No, if you give a man a games console, like, <laughs> sorry. But you wouldn't even let me set it up. Yeah, like, yeah. Oh, come on, I've got to cook dinner first. Straight away. Uh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, fucking, this is stressful. <laughs> I'm, like, genuinely, like, head, <laughs> head in hands. I and want that's why you keep holding so the run button. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. 
shut up. We're getting there. Oh, we should get one of the old, like, um, the, the Sega Genesis platformers, like the, the Disney ones, like Aladdin or something. Why well, the hell did you just annihilate that mole? Boom. Kamikaze. Fucking killed him. Moles don't know shit. Oh, all right. I need to breathe the wicked. Fucking, oh, we're, right. ma we're making progress. This is good. We're going to complete this game. All right, next time. Valley Ghost House. See you later. See you later, guys. Uh, sorry.